<laughs> that is interesting. I, I will say I've never done that before. Never done that before. This is a layer of freezing rain. Day five status. Well, it's still a nice skating rink. I don't think that's going anywhere. Nope. So nobody has been up here to plow our road. That is what it still looks like. Five days of snow. I'm not going anywhere on that. Uh-uh. Nope. And all the way down that hill, same way. Now, polite pass. All right. I'll see you guys later with an update of the next round of whatever's coming this way. Hopefully it won't be anything, but who knows? All right, the guys are on a mission. We're trying to get some snacks. So first time trying to get out. And I think it's maybe about 45 minutes from now that there's supposed to be some wintry weather coming in. So, yeah, nothing like heading out at the last minute. We're going to see if they can make it out. I'm going to stay here and take care of the home front. <laughs> Keep the fire burning. Here waiting on the guys. Oh, I just stepped in ice. I'm watching them on the, my little GPS thing. They're not far, but it's taking them a while. They're going really slow. So hopefully they're not running into trouble. They got some good snacks though, I think. Oh, I see them coming up the hill and there's the snow plow. It's been by here four times and not come down our road. So I don't know. <laughs> so what was the spending limit <clears throat> it was a lot it, i didn't have one today <laughs> if you left us alone okay and you shouldn't leave us alone okay unattended what'd you spend 128 dollars goodness mercy Denied. Day five, six of this mess. I'm starting to get a little stir crazy. Last night, we started having freezing rain and it was a disastrous mess. There were car pileups everywhere, which why people were out is beyond me, but emergency vehicles were stuck on the side of the road and they were trying to get records to come and they were stuck and it was just sheets of ice everywhere. So, I think that we got above freezing this morning, but things are melting a little bit now. Hopefully the, the black ice is gone. These temperatures moving in this weekend are just, I don't know. This is, yeah, this is hard to walk on. Just to get to the greenhouse is like taxing. <laughs> I'm trying to stay positive, I really am. Wait, there's a little, there's a little walkway right here. Oh, and it's not real slick either. I don't think. Anyway. So I got up at like one o'clock and looked outside and 
you could see the top of the snow was just like glistening. It was just shiny, just shiny glass on the top of it. It was, I'd never seen that before. Just never seen it. All right, I'm gonna get in the gravel. Okay, I can walk. <laughs> I can walk. That's amazing. Okay. It's the little things, y'all. Woo. Let's get in here. That's 75. I'm just gonna sit here and I'm gonna look at my palm trees over there. And pretend I'm somewhere else. Y'all that live in Florida, is it amazing right now? Do you, do you wish you were somewhere else? Or do you, do you love it? What do you think? Please, please let me know. Let me know in the comments. I always say, no, I'm gonna buy a big piece of property out in the country, which I'd love to do. But on days like this, I'm like, oh, give me a patch of ground on a beach somewhere where it's warm. <laughs> Maybe like a second home. Things are melting though, look at that. Well, it's four o'clock. It's been spitting snow all day long and it's 31. We've been breaking up ice and cleared out a pathway on the sidewalk and our driveway, which was like an inch thick. So we've been out here an hour doing that. And I'm frozen, I, like, I can't feel my lips. And the guys have decided that we don't have enough wood. So they're gonna try to get the tractor out and get wood in it. I don't know how I feel about that, but we'll see how that goes. But I'm gonna stand in here while I get the tractor out. Ooh, so cold. Yeah, it's very cold. <laughs> Everything's cold, I can't help that. <sighs> they need your help, they said. I don't know, Daddy said he needs you on standby. All hands on deck, he said. Here we go. Oh, it's sliding. Why do they always have dumb ideas? Every day. Oh, they're going back in there. Okay, smart. <laughs> Epic fail. <laughs> Didn't work. I'm glad they decided they weren't going to do it. They get down here and they'd slide into the woodshed, probably. It looks like they're in there talking up a plan. I don't know. How could we get it up there? Being so slick. It's a good thing we did buy that wood rack, though, because it's so big. We were able to put so much wood on it. If we would, I don't know what we would have done. Well, what's your idea? Well, we can get the truck back in there and get it. Well, they've decided that Seth's going to back his truck in here. I told him I didn't think the idea would work, but we'll see. I knew they could. <laughs> We got the wood rack filled up. I can't feel my lips. <laughs> Just gotta get his truck back up the hill. He seemed to have no problem. I'm gonna check the greenhouse stove and then I'm headed inside. I think it's a biscuit and gravy night. Sausage and eggs and something warm. <sighs> All right, let's see how this puppy's doing. Doing good. Give it another scoop.
Good afternoon. It is the next day. It's Saturday and there's still snow and it's really cold out today. It is 19 degrees right now and we're headed back down to three degrees tonight. So the roads are better though. Eli headed out today to go see his girlfriend Grace. They've missed each other this week so he made it there safely. He's had an hour drive. I was real hesitant in the previous days of wanting him to go, but I think it was clear enough today. Seth went out, he had to go get some fish food. He said the roads looked pretty good. The, par the parking lots were starting to clear out and I think they've shoveled a lot of it. But um, in the grassy areas and these back roads, it's still pretty icy. And look at the icicles up there. It's like they're just waiting to fall. <laughs> I was sitting here earlier and I think, oh, should I be sitting right here? I'm really trusting of this glass above my head. <laughs> All right, I think I'm gonna head down to the chicken coop. I need to check everybody down there. And I've just dreaded going down there today because the snow is so icy. When we had freezing rain, it just stuck to the top of it and it's not melted off. And with it being so cold today, I mean, I, it's really slick. I'm gonna take a hoe. This is not normally what I use a hoe for. But look at that, this is what's dripping off the roof. real fun. It's easier to walk in the tracks, I'm finding. Otherwise, that is super slick. If I had to do this all the time, I'd have proper attire and shoes for it, and it would make things a lot easier. Hey chickens, I'm coming! Y'all, I bet this thing would go sliding down the hills. <laughs> that is crazy! Hey chickens, how y'all doing down here? Somebody's laid an egg in the run. Why? Why? It's busted. Not surprising. Let's see if we can roll it down the hill. That is interesting. I, I will say I've never done that before. Never done that before. Another egg. What is going on? Nobody ever lays eggs in the run. Another cracked egg. All right, that water's good. Thank goodness for aquarium heaters. There ain't no way I'd want to be down here busting waters. I did that years ago and I was not ever doing that again. My goodness I'm amused by the small things y'all all right everybody's good I gave them some scratch I got another busted egg I should have come down here earlier I should have all right let's do it again <laughs> wow it's going really far look at that this is a layer of freezing rain Well, I'm going to head back up the hill.